Hi everyone, my name is Kevin Gregus. I'm a seminarian here at St. Juliana. This Lent, I want to invite you to a Bible study featuring the TV series, The Chosen. If you haven't heard of The Chosen, it's an incredible TV series, very new, that is all about the life of Christ and his followers, The Chosen. It's one of the best portrayals of Jesus that I have seen in any sort of media. And I want to share it with you and how it's changed my prayer life, how it can change your prayer life, the way we view scripture, the way we view Jesus. It really is this beautiful, beautiful portrayal. Uh, and they did a really nice job with it. So we'll dive in uh, this Lent. Uh, there'll be two options for the study. One will be after Mass on Tuesdays, uh, at nine, starting at 9.30. We'll start that uh, on February 23rd, during the first week of Lent. That will be in person in the parish center. It'll be limited to 20, about 20 people because of COVID restrictions. And then also, the other option is on Tuesday evening at 7 p.m. That will be on, all on Zoom. So we can have as many people there as we want. Each night we'll just get together, discuss it. Before you arrive, you'll have watched the episode and then we'll probably watch some clips and just discuss what it means for us. We'll have some questions, I'll have a, uh, some reflections for you and we'll just discuss the episode. Uh, the series, by the way, is free online. You don't need to pay for it. There's, an, there's an, actually an app you can download for it. It's, again, you, it's, they put it out there so as many people, they can reach as many people as possible. So I uh, hope you can join me uh, this Lent uh, and beyond in this study. And I'll include in this video a trailer for The Chosen just so you can kind of see what it's all about. So hope you can join us and God bless. Excuse me. I have something for you. For me. Throw this down for a catch. Uh, I don't have a quarrel with you, teacher. But we've been doing this all night. Nothing. All right. fruit here is incredible. Everything that grows here is immaculate. Except for the people. You're such a miserable lot. You worship one God, and yet you're all divided. Only one language keeps their peace. None to speak it. You are the great Nicodemus. And I serve only God. Yes. Yes, so do your enemies. Rogue preachers in the wilderness, raving about a coming Messiah. Sam, you're scared. I've lost everything. Burned every bridge. If I don't catch a ton of fish or get some help somehow, they'll arrest me. I'm trapped. No more talking, Simon. Maybe God can get your attention now. Who are you? Fear not, for I have redeemed you. I have called you by name. I saw him. It was incredible. You have experienced a miracle. You are healed. What do you want from me? Follow me. He performs miracles and seeks no credit? Who did this? I don't know his name. His time for men to know has not yet come. We, we've waited for you for so long, we believe. You have much bigger things ahead of you, Simon, son of Jonah. Anything is possible now, don't you see? Would you at least know him if you saw him again? <laughs> 
I will know him for the rest of my life. 